That's it. Fine. Good. Well, that looks okay. Go to the next post and pound that in. I hope you've grasped the basics. I got other matters to attend to, but there's more than a day's work here for you. All right. So long. I'll be counting sections when you're done. Okay. down and get over here, boy. Jim Milton, can you hear me? Hurry, hurry. Milton, get over here. Coming. Come on, give us a hand. Know much about bulls, Milton? Uh, just the basics. Don't make them mad. Angus Geddes, this is Jim Milton. Mr. Milton, Angus is your boss's son. Nice to meet you. Well, let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. I know how it Come feels. on, move! Come on. Oh. 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 Shit. I'll get him. Get a rope on him, Milton, and try and calm him down. Bad ball. this thing down you don't look like you're gonna wind down <laughs> but I'll try you got a temper on you there 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 oh there oh there easy easy it ain't so bad nice and easy now boy don't all better okay <laughs> now come on you hunk of Chuck you're lucky you didn't kill anyone. Got him, Mr. Dickens. Oh, good. How you doing, son? A bit sore, but I'll be okay. Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. And you, mister? Fine. He just got my head. <laughs> good. There he is. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. your mouth, boy. You will be the first one we kill. Leave him alone. <laughs> oh, careful, boys. Careful. Yeah. Look at this tough guy. Get out of here. How oh, fancy parents get is paying you to be tough for him, huh? <laughs> no, he's paying me to keep the place clean. Oh. Said he had some problems with vermin. Oh, listen to this. Real funny. <laughs> no! oh, oh, come on, get him! Come now. on, get him! Oh, kick his head in, Bob! Oh, boy! They didn't hire you because you're tough. 
It's because you're stupid. Brains ah. out. Oh, he's licking you, boss. He hit me first. Oh, you can fight, boy. I'll give you that. Well, how's your wife in a brawl? Leave my wife alone. Oh, she's real pretty. Get out of here. Oh, quite a temper you got. <laughs> Imagine you're you're frustrated with your lot in life. Married to a shit shoveling farmhand. <laughs> <laughs> well, what'd you do wrong to end up here? Leave my wife alone. Welcome to Big Valley, Jim Milton. Pleasure to meet you both. We'll see you again. And you, boy, tell Mr. Geddes we called. We'll be back. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Milton. Thank you. Don't worry about it. Stop acting like a goddamn storybook hero, will ya? What choice did I have? Plenty, you moron. Plenty. We all get caught eventually, John. I guess the trick is to decide by who. Dear, I won't hear any more of it. You won't hear any of it. Not in front of the men. You toad. All right, smile, smile. Do not embarrass me. Mr. Geddes? Hey, I heard we had another incident with the uh, Laramie boys. Yeah, there was an incident. Well, I mean to scare me. Are you scared? A little. I've got a lot invested in this place, and, and not just the land, but, but my family. It's, uh... It's hard to explain. I understand. I'll do my best to keep you safe, sir. Yeah, I know you will. So how's your family? Uh, just fine. I should probably head back. <laughs> yeah, I know how it is. <laughs> How'd you get on? Okay, I guess. Better? Sure, I'm just tired. I know. Anybody want some more? Uh, no, no, I'm thank good. You. I miss Mr. Pearson. John Marston, you're such a pig. <laughs> 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 All right, it's getting late. Let's get some rest. Good night, Jack. Good night, Mama. Good night, Jack. Good night, Pa. What the hell was that? What are you, what are you doing? My job, Abigail. Lock this door behind me. Don't open it unless you know it's me. Oh, Jim, um, you gotta do something. Uh -oh. Two of them by the stall. They got tough. Oh. It's over. It's a rich man. Take him back to Hagendorf. Who's this? New hand. Where's Gaddy's now? Crap. That's the worst. You ain't very. You know tough. that? I lost my wind. They've killed Mr. Tobert. And they've stolen my goddamn cattle. 
You men are okay? I think so. Yeah. Jim Milton saved my life. It's Mr. Abel. Yeah, of course, it's Mr. Abel. I can't believe he thinks he can scare me out of here. Then I guess we're getting your cattle back, I guess sir. we are. Can you go too, Tom? Of course, sir. All right, Jim, I know you can handle yourself. A little. Go get your guns and head out. Guns? Oh, don't play coy with me, son. We need your help. I don't care what you used to do or what your, your, your name is. This is the land of second chances. Understood. Okay. Come in, it's me. What was it? Mr. Getty's cattle was taken. God, I'm sorry to hear that. What are you doing in that thing? Mr. Getty's been real good to us. We, I. What are you doing? My job, Abigail. My goddamn job. I'll lead the way. This is gonna be the last we hear out of them. Your horse is here. We'll be better on foot. Okay. If you say so. That's the place up ahead. There's our cows. A couple guards out front. A couple more around the side, I imagine. Let's get a closer look. Let's go. Yeah. There's plenty of guards. I'm gonna head straight in. Yep, Tom. You head up there and try and give us some cover. Abe, you're gonna try and flank the place and come in from the back. I'll give you a minute or two, then I'm heading in. Yes, sir. Okay. Hey! Hey! You boys been coming up to... said something about my wife. Fist digging, shit shoveling, backwoods, sacker, no good, trash. Ugh! <laughs> 
You know that woman of yours got the look of a woman ain't had a real ride in her life. She's gotta make do with some piss poor stinking farmhand. Hey, hey, tell her I'll let her in my sheets. As long as she bathes first. <laughs> You're a good girl now. You're back. You did real well, Mr. Milton. This man can really fight. Save the whole place. Ah, uh, that weren't nothing. Well, you, oh, you, <laughs> you saved my life. No need to say nothing, sir. Just doing my job. Now, I don't think they'll be back tonight, but how about Abe? Just in case you stay up. Yep. You see anything or hear anything, you fire that rifle. Three times. Three times. We'll all come running. We'll do. Uh, well said. And thank you, Mr. Milton. Truly. Just glad to be of service, sir. Uh, I understand. You get some rest. Thank you, Mr. Geddes. What? What? What choice did I have? Just answer me that. What was I supposed to do? Just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once. That's all I'm saying. How are you getting on? Surviving. I think. Here. I'll get you some coffee. Only thing I know how to do is... Well, you know. Undertakers like me. Cattle? Not so much. That ain't true. I ain't no rancher. Rustled horses, not raised them. Stole cattle, not birthed them. I was... I was reading the newspaper. I was reading about a old ranch, Beecher's Hope, down by Blackwater. Was you? Well, Jack read it to me, but I thought maybe we could raise some money, 
Bank could lend us the rest. We could be happy, John. We Bank could... loans? I got a goddamn price on my head, woman. I know. I know all about that. Every time we about to get somewhere, make something, you go and show the entire world that you ain't Jimmy Milton. Every place we've been, it's been the same. We start doing okay, and then boom. You act like the big man with the gun. I'm tired, John, and I guess I was dreaming a little. At least give me that. Just feels hopeless. You're, you're doing better. Milton! Milton, ma'am, Mr. Geddes needs you to head over to Strawberry in the wagon and collect some mail for him at the post office. Sure. I'll take the boy with me. He's getting soft. Lancelot! Come on. Jim, if you're heading that way, can you pick up a parcel for me? A dress I ordered. I think it's in your name? My name. I think so. One's in your name, and the other one's in mine. O only one should have come in by now. How much shopping you done? Why the... Oh, yes, a real keen purchaser of goods, me. Look at him. <laughs> okay, Lancelot. We'll make a man out of you yet. Not too much of a man, mine. He's only a boy. I hope, I hope some of this... Show him how to drive the wagon, that audio you know? if it didn't... Save the... That's really what got really uploaded. Of adulthood for another day. Come on, get! You take care now. Of course. Okay. It's nice getting out of the house, huh? I hate, I hate, I hate, I hate that when people say, oh, 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 you're getting soft boys for that. It's just, just sounds a bit horrible to me. Ma said it was pride or something. Ma was wrong about that. Here, want to take the reins a little? I, I don't know, Pa. Uh, it's easy, boy. Don't be scared. Well, uh, w what do I do? Well, just hold him and pull him short to slow down. Tell him to go faster. Give him a little switch. And then pull to one side if you want to turn. Here, try it out. Slow down! Did you hear that? Just went, slow down! Oh, it's convenient. This is a thing about 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 that. It's that so this game it's just so like when the game's over it isn't really over. Like GTA it's kind of over within a couple of missions. Strawberry, eh, kid? Looks like. You know, I think this is the longest I've seen you without a book in your hand. It was foolish to forget mine, sir. Look, I got some business to attend to with the clerk. I leave you with the wagon. Can I trust you not to drive off with it? Oh, I think I can be trusted to that. Very good. All right. Here we are. You all right, son? Sure. Well, cheer up a little. You wait here. I won't be long. Okay. And if you behave, I might let you drive us home. Can't wait. That doesn't sound like a reward. Austin, what are you doing? Hi. I'm here to... Name? My name? Uh, Jim Milton. Jim Milton. Hmm. <laughs> nope. Nothing here. Uh, maybe try Marston. John Marston. It's a long story. Okay. John Marston. Marston. Oh shit. Nope. Nothing here for that name either. Try Abigail Rogers. She had us. He, Abigail Roberts. He knows who we are. Abigail Roberts. Hmm. Yes, here we are. 
And also, I'm here to pick up the deliveries for Pronghorn Ranch. David Getty sent me. Pronghorn? Yes, er, uh, oh, er, uh, sign here. We have a bunch okay. of stuff for you. And I will help you out. I'll take these. You get the rest of the stuff. Thank you. Here, let me help you with wow. this, Mr. Marston. I'm oh, voice cracked. Mostly Milton these days. It's a long story. Whatever you say, Mr. Milton. It's not important. Take care now. Give my regards to Gettys. Thank you very much, mister. Okay. Let's get out of here. Everything okay, Pop? Sure. Should be. I hope so, at least. Here. You take the reins a little. I ain't sure. Come on, son. You'll enjoy it if you try a little harder. Okay. Okay, Pa. Yeah. So, uh, we're going back to Pronghorn, okay? So, okay. Wait, we've come all the way out here and we're just gonna turn around and go back? That's what we're doing. Turns out, uh, I missed the seclusion of the ranch more than I figured for. Don't you want to go to the store or the saloon or anywhere? We're going back. Okay, boy? But... I've been sitting in this wagon I don't know how long. But nothing. Keep on driving and watch the road. Yes, sir. Thank you. Jesus. Mind your father, okay? I got my reasons, even if I don't care to explain them. Yes, sir. Better. Jesus. Look, if I tell you to speed up, speed up. If I say slow down, you slow down, okay? Uh, sure. I like I liked him when he was that was cute and he was innocent. Yeah. Who's this? What's that horse? Was that a question for me? No. No, keep driving. Hey. Get. Oh, you just got going this What's horse. Wrong, Nothing. All right, speed up. Let's get away from there. Okay. Pee up. Holy shit, he drives better than me. Is somebody back there? Just keep driving. Slow it down. Don't want to seem like we're running away from anything. Uh, okay. Whoa! Well, I don't like driving across here. It's the same as any other road. Look where you want to go and the horse will follow. Okay. I think the horse is getting skittish. You'll be all right. Huh? What? Nothing. Just keep driving. Oh shit. Okay. This isn't what? good. What's wrong? Don't look around. Oh, Pop. Hey. Those men. Are they following us? Just, just stay calm. See that fallen tree? When we get there, stop the wagon, jump down, and hide. Oh, Pop. Good. You need to do exactly as I say, boy. Alright. We're gonna have to deal with these folk, haven't we? Uh, come on. Quick. Down. Okay, son, you wait here. You don't move or say nothing until I speak to you. You hear? Yes, sir. All head right. down. Okay, you already moved. Okay, you just head. Let's see what you come calling about. What do you boys want with us? Oh, we just want to have a friendly chat. Are you John Marcy? You sure look like him. 
What of it? Come here, partner. We don't mean no trouble. I hope not. I'm just a farmer, friend, and I don't have no money on. You're talking bullshit, Mr. Killer! <laughs> Yeah, all in one shot. It's okay. You're okay. What? Why? What? It's okay. It's okay. Come on. Keep them eyes closed. Let's go. Come on. Get up. Oh dear, those men. I told you not to look, boy. Are they? Dead. I didn't have much of a choice. You saw that. Uh -oh. You killed them, Paul. Son, I need you to hold it together. You were real brave back there. Real brave. Just stay on the road. Did exactly like I said. Really? Uh huh. Hmm. If you hadn't listened. Things could have gone real wrong for us. There, there. Is that Jack Marson is just not not a good like like at the end of like Red Dead Redemption One we play as him. He's not a great character. To be honest, he's just a bit boring. He's having a panic We're attack. Okay. Hey, uh, you know, your mama wants us to buy some old ranch. You read to her about it, didn't you? Mm -hmm. What was it called? Mm -hmm. What was the name, boy? Beecher's Hole. That's right. Beecher's Hole. Over by Blackwater. You like the idea of that, huh? Us own the ranch? I don't know. I can see you as ranchers, boy. Like Duncan Gettys, huh? I wasn't so sure, but yeah, that kind of life might suit us. Yeah. It wouldn't be such a chore if the horses we were cleaning up after was ours, would it? <laughs> no, it wouldn't. Mm. All right, boy. All right. Okay. Cowboy scalp is fucking ranch. This is bored the arse out of me. Okay, here we are. That was an uh, eventful trip. Uh, I won't call it eventful. I'm call it kind of a bit domestic. Say hi to your mother. Someone who knew me. If we didn't get to them particulars, I'm sorry. My son. Our son. Well, what, what were we supposed to do? What even a dress? It was a gift for you. Oh no. Oh no. Motherhood. Hey, Mr. Jim? Mr. Jim? Mr. Jim? Hey! Uh, there's, uh, there's a, a telegram, telegram messenger for you. Over there. there. In, near the house. There is? Okay. Thanks, Abe. Alright. What do you think you want? I have no idea. But I doubt someone wants to give me a big pile of money. I see him. Thanks, Thanks Abe. Ah. Uh. 
Excuse me, mister. I'm Jim Milton. Heard you had a telegram for me? Yes, here. Sign there. Thank you. Jim, stop. If you're the JM I know, stop. It's Sadie Adler. I've got Sadie. something to discuss. Pay good. Meet me in saloon in Valentine. I'm there most days. Stop. Sadie Adler. I'll be damned. He just read, read out all the stops. Why is he doing that? Abigail! Where's she gone? Where's Jack gone? Oh yeah, they've took off. It's very similar to Michael. Darling John, a kind lady in the village helped me write this. She had men problems of her own, but that's a different story. Listen, I have begged you, but it don't seem to make much difference. I've tried everything I know to make you grow up. And you know I love you, but loving you means I can't watch you do this. Time after time, we've had to run because of your behavior and your decisions. We got a son. I've got a son. And I love our son enough that I can't have him around by you like this. I had so many dreams, John. Oh. I hoped you would change. We all saw what happened to them that didn't, but you... Part of you is hell-bent on ending up the same way. I love you too much to watch that no more. Aww. Damn it. Aww. Why is everybody leaving me? Where's the wife, Milton? Uh, she's out. I saw her leaving with the boy and the bags. What's going on? You married, Mr. Dickens? No. That don't surprise me. What'd she do? Catch you with a showgirl? We hear about you shooting more fellas over by Strawberry? Just who are you, Jim Milton? I'm a family man. Or the family guy. A gun. Sure. Them men shot at me. Just interested, that's all. Ain't nothing interesting. Unless you find gossip about a man's marriage worthy of your time. Guess not. There's work to be done. Unless you're running off too. I ain't going nowhere. I'm here to work. Gotta save money, get her what she wants. What does she want? She wants a place of her own. Said she found a plot up at Beecher's Hope. You? A rancher? You'll starve. Probably. Keep yourself busy. Take your mind off it. Trying to work. More. Well, I think I'll leave this video here now. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. Check out check out my other stuff if you're interested. Or or you can you know just never come back. Oh, please do.